Thanks to Ford for powering our CES coverage. For Hack 5, I'm Darren Kitchen here at CES 2012 checking out the latest from Asus. This right here, no, it's not a netbook, it's not a laptop. This is the Asus Transformer Prime. It's the TF201. It has a 1280 by 800 display. It has a bigger brother that's coming out soon, the TF700. That'll be available in May with a slight upgrade from this, a whopping 1920 by 1200. That's the one that I want. And it has a uh, slightly improved higher megapixel camera in the front end. We got a camera in the back end too. Um, this right here is running Android Gingerbread, but by the time this airs, it will be running uh, Ice Cream Sandwich, which will potentially make this the first tablet to enter the market with Ice Cream Sandwich. So that's what's got me all excited, aside from the fact that it's running the NVIDIA Tegra 3. Wait. Well, way to bury the lead, Darren. This thing's got the Tegra 3. That's a quad-core tablet. It actually has a fifth core. So is that a five? I don't even know what the word is for that. But the extra fifth core is just to run like little background processes, the wallpaper, unessential stuff, save battery life. Speaking of which, 10 hours of battery life on the tablet itself, and then this keyboard edition here, sold separately for $149, will add an extra uh, six hours of battery life, in addition to giving you a 90 2% uh, QWERTY keyboard here. Uh, so the price point on the 201 32 gig model is uh, $499. The 700, which will be available in May, is going to be $599. And uh, there's rumors that might potentially have some FCC documentation sometime soon for potentially 3G. I don't know. That's what I'm excited about because I'm using this thing as a VoIP phone, you know? That'll fit in my pocket, right? Huh? Move over, Galaxy Note. Anyway, this is what I'm excited about. Specifically, Hack5 audience will know that uh, the first generation of this guy runs Backtrack 5. And, oh yes, USB. So, you know, that's what I'm looking for. Okay. Anyway, for more coverage over uh, here at CES 2012, go ahead and head over to revision3.com slash CES. And thanks once again to Ford for powering our CES 2012 coverage. The Ford Fiesta features intelligent access with push-button start. The remote keyless entry eliminates the need for keys and starts your Fiesta with the push of a button. You can't say enough about the simplicity of just being able to walk up to the car, open the door, and drive away without fishing around in your pockets. Thanks to Ford for powering our CES coverage.